Symptoms of Menopause. Hi, Dr. Davidson here from ProgressYourHealth.com. In this presentation, I'm going to talk about symptoms of menopause. Now, menopause isn't just one day in the life of a female, it's actually a phase. In some women, menopause can be a long phase, and some women it can be a short phase or anywhere in between. But when women are just entering menopause, some of the common symptoms I'll hear are their irregular periods. So whether they're missing periods, so they go several months without a period, or sometimes women will complain about having two periods in a month, or continuous bleeding where they're spotting, 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 spotting for days and days and days where they don't get a reprieve from that. Or on the other hand there, I get a lot of times where women will say they get very heavy bleeding when they're just entering menopause. Of course, your typical hot flashes and night sweats, um, very, very common when entering menopause. But also I hear a lot about low energy, just brain fog, forgetfulness. Women will say they have a, they recognize a face, but they can't remember the name, or it just takes an extra, extra microsecond to process something. Or moms will say, instead of put on your shoes, they'll say, put on your socks. And even though they meant something else, it's, they just get very forgetful, their memory, their cognitive function. Also, um, irritability, where that patience just gets really short and they get impatient, especially with their family. Or sad or anxious is very common as well. Also, with menopause, is women complain about a low sex drive. Their, their sex drive ran off with their energy, um, very low libido. And with that low libido comes some vaginal dryness or pain with intercourse and dry hair and skin, which that in part comes with more of the estrogen. Estrogen is very hydrating to the cells. It keeps the cells very hydrated with fluid, so it keeps them nice and thick and plump. But when you think about estrogen dropping, that's going to dehydrate the cell, so that's where you get kind of that look to the skin where it looks very thin or crepey. Um, that's where the vaginal tissues are so hydrated by estrogen. When the estrogen drops, they get a lot of dryness and pain with intercourse. Also, you'll see a lot of bloating. Estrogen and progesterone, estrogen in particular, is very important for digestion. So a lot of women entering menopause or in menopause will complain about that they get this bloating that they've never had before. Um, also, um, weight gain, especially weight gain in the middle. And as the female hormones drop, the waistline gets thicker, and it has nothing to do with calories. Um, also, I'll, I'll get women complaining of trouble sleeping. That's a big one. They have no trouble falling asleep at night, but might wake up between 12 and 3 in the morning and just be up, like it's morning time. And then by the time they do, to, do get tired and want to fall asleep, it's time to wake up for the day. Um, I'll also get women that have trouble falling asleep. Um, more women waking in the night, but the women that tell me that they have trouble falling asleep is that they're so tired and their body is tired, but they just can't seem to turn off their mind. That's an, another complaint that I'll get as well. So now that I've talked to you about the symptoms of menopause, be sure to watch our next video in this series called Causes of Menopause to learn more. So for more information, go ahead and visit our website, which is www.progressyourhealth.com.